Hmm, who should I pick? That is an excellent question. Good choice. Right. So I'm Demon Trigger. And these are two guys with me. Yeah. We certainly uh, are two guys. Yeah, I'm a guy named Freezing Inferno. That's not <laughs> me. I'm I'm Ori. Hi Ori. I like this music. It's from a uh, Kirby's Dreamland 3, I think. Yeah. I like that game. Really good song. It's probably my favorite stage track in the game. You don't like Sand Canyon? Well, Sand Canyon's good too, although it's kind of overplayed. Uh, I suppose you're right there. Give yeah. good music. So anyway, Napalm Bomb is aimable in three directions, which is something I haven't learned until this LP. Makes it even more useful than I thought it was, so... And there's a problem. <laughs> <laughs> that was fast. I, I believe in that end just because you mentioned that. Yeah. Oh my. And of course, more extra lives because this game still wasn't easy enough. My god, look at that. <laughs> and another one. I guess they didn't tweak that from regular Mega Man 5. Yeah. So now it's time for the jet bike section. Oh boy! Or... I guess not. Oh. Oh, it's... Just this. Okay. Yeah, basically, you go over the water of the jet bike section. Well, that's pretty cool. Something kind of funny is if you fall in that water, it'll push you all the way back to the left. Oh, that... For whatever reason. I don't know if that's funny or just annoying. Well, well, it's also a pit, too, so it's like it pushes you to the left, but then you still fall to your death. So. Oh, okay, okay. That, that, that is a, okay, that's actually kind of neat. I don't know why, because unless you're, like, on the bottom of the platforms, it's not going to do anything to you. It's true. Also going to throw more rocks at people, because why not? Gotta use that power stone. It's clearly the best weapon. And now, we got Beat Cannon. Cannon. Which is a charge beat. Oh my god. It goes... So... It passes through basically everything and does double the damage of a normal charge shot. Kinda reminds me of... So your what you're saying is... Charging Fist? It's... Mega Man 5 GB? It's... Yeah. Not as good as regular beat. Uh... Well, I don't know. It do Since it does double the damage, you could do stuff like that. To kill a lot of things, and it... Really wrecks boss. Are we gonna wreck Wave Man with it? No, nah, I just use the regular Buster. Oh. Wave Man is a huge pain in the ass because he always pops up underneath you, and he ha and he does uh, water spouts in groups of three, which also come up underneath you and block shots. My God! Well, props to you, Hacker, for making Wave Man an actual viable, interesting fight. Yeah. The harpoons also stick into you, and if you don't mash buttons, it'll keep doing damage to you. But the attacks only do two damage, so you can damage race him pretty easily. Yeah, he seemed like he died pretty quick. Yeah. I gotta say, for that fight, the rewards are definitely not worth it. Oh, well, what's his weapon? I want to use the harpoon, I guess. Uh, first you get Water Wave, which uh, spirals up in a weird pattern that's... It's basically the Power Stone of this game. And Super Arrow is oh a huge God. piece of crap, but we'll talk about that in the next stage. Which is, of oh. course, the Smug Fortress, so... Oh no! We will see you then.